Okay. I am ending my day, my business day. I think I got started around nine o'clock. I got started before nine, but I had to go to the supply store. Another thing you have to realize in business, I just had a, a client call me and she, and, and I had already told her, I said, your bill should not be any more than $85 a month. I don't, I don't foresee it being any more than that. So her bill was $85 or 86 and some change. Mind you, I made her aware of the price increase that was gonna take place come April. It is now April. So she called me and she was calling over the $10. Calling over the $10. I'm gonna say this loud and clear. I want you guys to repeat this. You are in business to turn a profit and not break even. If you're only breaking even in business, go 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 and work for corporate America. You know, uh, at least Uncle Sam could take the taxes out of your uh, out of your paycheck, and, and they can offer you some some type of some type of good insurance. Hopefully, it's good insurance. But it, you got to remember that you're you're in business to turn a profit. All of those shirts that cost five dollars at Walmart, they get them for probably uh, seventy cent. You know, they, they buy them in bulk. And that's how much profit that they're turning. So when she called me to, to finagle her way out of the $10, I reminded her of the conversation that we had um, a month or two prior said, stating, hey, I told you I don't foresee your bill being any more than $85. Well, you're, you're listing that one tab costs $5.42. Yes, yes, I, I am listing that for bookkeeping purposes. In case I ever need to take a loss on your account, I need to itemize everything. And I could hear uh, her drunk, whatever he is in the background, saying that, that uh, well, we can buy a bucket of tabs for $200 and you can still come clean the pool. And I told her, I said, I, I asked her a rhetorical question. I said, so you mean that it's okay to raise you. Are, are you saying that I can still charge you $85 and you just want to purchase the chemicals? Well, no, that's not what I'm saying. I said, well, that doesn't do me any good. Fight for yours. Fight for yours. You got Netflix that, that bumps people up by four or five dollars. You got gas going up by 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 increments of, of, of 10 cent and five cent here or there. If you're a small business, if you're a mom and pop. Yeah, fight for yours. And if you got to let that person go, let them go. Because I told her, I said, hey, I encourage you to make a couple calls around the valley. And mind you, you've been at $70 since 2012-ish, let's just say that. Oh, I, I told her, I said, you got guys that are walking here and I'm going to call them white boys. You got the white boys that walk in here and they'll charge you 110 to 120 without batting an eye. And they will leave if they don't get that price. I had uh money. Well, how big is her how big is her uh spa or her spool? No, uh, it's probably about maybe 7500 I got something half that size paying 140 No sweat off my back. Here's the thing, I would have rather let her go. If she didn't take 85, I was willing to part with the account. I do not fight over pricing. If you see the price of eggs jump up, the price of Southwest gas, the price of electricity, no, nah, I've got bills to pay too. Especially if your house is twice the size of my house. I don't have two standard poodles walking around. <laughs> Yeah, you're not in business to break even. You're in business to turn a profit. You're not in business to be nice. You're not in business to be competitive with the next man next to you. Your price is your price. In the city of Las Vegas, we got a lot of things going on here. 
<laughs> I'm not I'm not gonna say what those things are, but those people will let you know my price is my price. Take it or leave it. Because I know somebody's gonna jump on it. Now I'm not saying at the same time to practice or have unfair business practices and, and straight go uh, AWOL with your pricing. I'm saying have a well-rounded view of everybody's price. Yeah, if they wanted to, if they wanted to buy a bucket of tabs, you know, if they wanted to buy a bucket of tabs, by all means, buy buy, buy a bucket of tabs that may last you two, three years. Go ahead and spend it two hundred seventy dollars. Go ahead, go ahead, spend that two seventy. Or, or why don't you just pay me the additional eighty five I'm asking for? You know, whether you decide to do it or not, there is still going to be a price on my back, a price on my labor, a price on my insurance that I have to pay for health. I said, all that costs. No, 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 no. I'm in business to turn a profit. Plain and simple. I do not debate pricing. If I have to debate pricing, all I'm going to do is advise you what I advise to her. I encourage you to call around. You, matter of fact, you, we can we can end service here, and mind you, you've already paid for the month. I'll take that as a thank you, and I'll advise you to call around. I'll advise you to call around. If she didn't pay the additional, you know, you would have saw that rolled over to the next bill, or I would have just terminated the service. I do not argue over pricing. There is a, a plethora. There's a bunch. <laughs> There's a multitude of pool guys around. Why don't you call around? Call, call. Matter of fact, they're all up and down the street. Mind you, call them around and bring them into your backyard. Show them the invoice I showed you. And see what they say. Remember, you're in business to turn a profit, not break even. And I'm sorry, <laughs> let me end with this. If you find this information useful to you, smash that like button <laughs> if you don't like it smash the dislike button let me know you're there subscribe hit the bell notification I got lots more stuff to talk about than than uh than business but I'm, I'm, I'm I might live here for a little bit I might live here for a little bit till we start getting the uh the subscriber count up so I can get back to playing that music that you guys like to hear peace and have a good night